There we go. Devolver Digital. In your face. Let's turn this bad boy. I'm going to crank the music back up because I, I kind of felt bad lowering it. It does have autosave. It's weird though because when we played yesterday, it didn't prompt me with any any save options. Oh, also before we continue, let me do this. Um, I want to thank everyone who has donated to our St. Jude Play Live campaign. We are over $300 raised, which is awesome. I love your faces. Goes to a great cause. And the total campaign for St. Jude is just under 2 mil raised. Just under 2 mil. So if you want to check out that campaign, our campaign, join our team, or we just want to donate to the charity, more than welcome to uh, head on over there. Check it out. Awesome, awesome cause. You already know. Fantastic work um, that they do for the kids and the families affected, you know, with childhood cancer, leukemia, things like that. And the families don't have to pay a dime. And that's awesome. You know, that's the last thing a family should have to worry about is paying for hospital bills whenever, you know, their kids are going through treatments and things like that. So we try to help out as much as we can. And I thank everybody who has donated to our charity so far. This is our third year. It's not our last. Guarantee you. Let's continue. I don't know where it's going to leave us off. Or where it left us off. I'm really curious. Oh, okay. It left us off right where I came. So let's bump that. Let's bump that up a little bit. Yes. I want to hear more of this. This is so good. Even the little tiny little sound effects in the game just are just so amazing. I'm ready to be blown away again. Day two, blown away, jaw on the floor. <laughs> I just want, now, you know it's bad though, it's playing this, I want more of this, you know? Like I just want more of this in my life. More games of this caliber, like this artistry. And I was seeing a lot of games that came to mind yesterday that I played like Titan Souls is amazing. It's such a minimalist game. And there's a couple of games that are coming up that I'm really excited for, like Tunic. Ooh. Wow. <laughs> that that caught me by what? what? Is it when I'm Okay. It's when I'm really close to it. I mean, it's just I don't know, that's just awesome looking. Oh, that, wow. I didn't realize until yesterday how much I said beautiful in a reference to this game. That is just blowing me away. Oh, I wonder. Okay, can't do nothing with that. I don't want to hurt the pretty tree though. <laughs> it's too beautiful. I didn't want to I don't want to damage that. But hopefully everyone's having a good Tuesday. Welcome back to Gris. Our amazing journey continues. Look at Like just sit here all day. And just be caught mesmerized bamboozled oh wait is this the okay I about to say this is the area where that fish thing was whoa man that lighting is so good oh take me away oh I didn't realize what, I did not I did not realize oh I bet there's a secret over here I can feel it yeah there definitely is a secret over there the question is can I get there can I jump to that yes oh heck yeah See, I'm going to want to go back and get every single secret thing in this. Whatever these things are. And we don't know. We don't have no clue about what 
you know those things represent because this game is very metaphorical and I, when i was listening to the soundtrack today i was kind of piecing some things together in my mind of based on the experience that i've had with it so far and it's definitely one that leaves up realms of interpretation you know and i love that i don't like to be just directly told what the story is or the what the themes are I just want to I just want to enjoy it, you know? I just want to enjoy the adventure. And think about it after, not try and figure it out beforehand. Oh, I could definitely get up there. Okay. I can't get up there all the way. No, oh, man, listening Listen to the soundtrack in game after listening to it all day long. It's so pretty. It's such a different experience because you have all that ambiance of the game itself. Oh. Oh. What? <laughs> Oh, I love that. It's literally just moving painting beauty. Oh, no. I feel like there's a secret over here. Oh, never mind. It's not a secret. The water trees. They hold the secrets. I'm going to be upset when this game's over with. I'm going to be 100% real. I'm going to be pretty upset when this is over with. Because it's an amazing journey. over this way? Nope. We're going straight up. It's a good day. That is true. Nighttime pancakes are the best. Building the constellations. We're rebuilding our. I don't know. I'm trying to. I'm still trying to figure that part out. It's like our guide, guidance, our our purpose, our journey. It's it's very much interpretation. Very very much. An interpretation. I don't know what these two are either. But every bit of this is just... Ugh. Wait, can I go down here now? Oh, I can. It's because I can swim. What secrets do you hold? That oh, there's one. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. That was back. Actually, I remember going this way. You could you could take any frame of this game and put it on your wall. And people be like, that is beautiful. <laughs> it's just so good. There was another game, too, that I played. I didn't finish, but I wanted to play it... Um, it's on my Xbox, actually. I started it, and it has a very unique art style. And I remember I was super excited for it. The only thing I think when I played it that kind of turned me away was um, it had some performance issues. Like, that would really, really slow down a lot. And it was kind of unfortunate. 
But it was a very pretty game. Very, very pretty game. I feel like a lot of these studios, you know, they, they do well. Like, they do fantastic. But mainstream, man, they just... Sadly, just don't get some of that awesome recognition. So there's two for this tower. And I love to play them. I love to find these amazingly well-crafted gyms that and then people just like, oh, I've heard about it. Like, you hear it a lot. Like, I've heard about the game, but I never played it myself. <laughs> but I'm like, well, I'm not going to be one of those people that's like, oh, man, I wish I played that game, you know? You tell me about it, I'm going to go check it out. Because I'm hella interested. Oh, maybe these are the different realms. Because this is where the forest was. And then we have... There was one down there that was... I think this is just in general, you know? Where do you go when the other guy turns the shadow into an arrow? Oh, yeah, oh, I... Yes, yes, I know, yes. I've recently seen that too. I loved it. I think this is the sky part. So it seems like these are all derivative of the areas that they're a part of. Yeah, that, that cracked me up. I love that. Where'd he go? It turns into the <laughs> it turns into the little arrow. I mean, literally, this frame right here. Picturesque. Absolutely picturesque. You cannot tell me that that, that you know. Hold on. I gotta do another one. Everybody's asking. I'm like I'm like begging people to go check out the game because <laughs> they really need to see for themselves how amazing it is. I love this. I'm like blowing people's mind. They're like, "What is this game? It's so gorgeous." I'm like, well, <laughs> do I have a story for you? I was actually talking on uh, there. Some people mentioned uh, Samurai Jack, which with the eel makes sense. You know, with that that oozy black liquid I could see how that would that would kind of bring up those notions I would love to see, what is this hello oh hello little bug thing oh what my little firefly leading the way thank you you're so nice. Nope. Oh, gotta break that. We're gonna go higher. And higher. Oh, I don't need to break those. Oh my goodness. Wait, I feel like there's more I need to explore. I really feel like I need to go down. Oh wait, I can't go down no more. Oh, that's that's unfortunate. Well, I guess there's no turning back now. Wow. Place in the game, sell animal friends all stare at you. <laughs> Yikes. Look at this though. How many games like have you played that just Wow. That just wow the crap out of you. Just visually. Ooh. Whoa. Mm. I can tell you right now, there's only been a handful. This is one of them. Oh, wait. Oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa. Oh, wow. I did not know I had to do that. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, no. OK, 
Okay. Okay, maybe if I fall down. Yes. Like this... You just want to stay here. You don't want to go anywhere. You just want to just breathe it in. We have another one of those secrets. Hello, young samurai. How are you today? We are playing Gris. Enjoying this goodness. See another streamer play this? This game is beautiful. I am blown away. This is our day two. We uh, started this yesterday. It's been on my backlog for way too long. Way too long. And it rightfully deserves to be played and enjoyed and just oohed and odd at to every degree. Yes. Yeah. That, oh, I, I keep up with the updates regularly. <laughs> I literally watch update videos on the daily. I didn't update it today, though. But uh, I'm looking forward to all the stuff that they've added. Especially the maps. Ooh. Can I grab you? Oh, okay, okay. Oh, I love this astral look. Heavens. Sky. Celestial feel. It's freaking awesome. Hopefully you're doing well. Let's go down. I want to go down. Oh, oh, oh. I think we can go up there. Almost guarantee we can go up there. Oh, maybe not. Okay, I can't go that way. My bad. Really wanted to go that way. Oh, there is something over there. Hello? Maybe I can get to it this way. Oh, there's something over there. I want to find it. I'm excited though. And then they added uh, stuff to the gulag and they've retweaked it a lot of. They've retweaked some stuff, you know? Oh, I do have to go this way. I'll tell you what, it's, it's really cool to be able to play games like The Surge 2, which is great. It's a fantastic game, but it's, you know, the Soulsy like experience, rough, gritty. Um, hardcore, and then you play something like this that just takes you to a whole nother spectrum. I love that about games. I just love them. Break this. Ah, there's another one of... There was something back the other way, and I guarantee it was a secret. I guarantee it. Wait, are oh, you gonna follow me now? That means I can tot- Oh, I can't get up that way. That sucks. Too bad I can't use you to boost up, that'd be great. Okay, we're gonna need some some help here. Where's our other little other little friend down here? Hello. We're getting so many friends on this in this game, and then you hate to see him leave. Like our square blockhead guy that was in the forest, the rock guy. It was an absolute joy. Wait. Okay. Okay, so I need to get you. Oh, he only leads me a certain way. There we go. Follow me, little firefly friend. Let's 
So graceful. <laughs> I love it. Now we can go back or not go back. Oh, how? Where are we supposed to go from here? Oh, maybe this thing can only travel so far. That might be what it is. Need help? <laughs> oh, me? No, no. I like to. I'm gonna figure it out. Don't worry. We've gotten this far. We'll, we'll get it. I love the I love the the puzzle parts of these games. Like that's the great part, you know. I need to get down. Yeah, I need to get Hmm. I'm gonna have to dismiss that somehow and then go back. Cause it I can't go through the floor if the thing is there. You know, I was actually surprised the water part of this game that I've played so far. Um, usually those are the annoying parts. It was really awesome. Really, really, really awesome. Okay. There you go. Oh, I see what I need to do. I figured it out, yeah? You can you have to dismiss them that way. Mentioned them before. Turing test, yeah. I played uh I thought I played Numa. Outstanding relatively calm games, incredible stories, yeah. I think I'd played that one. Did it it had a lot of it was a very puzzle heavy game, wasn't it? I'm pretty sure I played that one. Oh, shoot. I made them both go away. Yikes. <laughs> there we go. I need to get you. Yeah, so I have to do the... I didn't know the block... My block form. My ultimate form was going to scare them away. That's my favorite part about these puzzle games, though, is, is that aha moment when you figure something out, you know? I love it. I swear, it's like when you open up a present every time. You just get taken back. Oh. Hello. Goodbye. <laughs> okay, there's definitely something over yonder. Fishies. I love it though. I yeah, I didn't play the Turing test though. My wife played the Turing test and she said it was really good. I haven't played it myself. Alright, I feel like we need to grab something. The little umbrella or the little uh arrow thing is definitely on on point. Like, I want to take that, print it out, put it on my game room wall whenever we move. I want something from this game for sure. Some artwork. I got some awesome plans for that room. Like, seriously good plans. To decorate it out. Oh, what secrets do you have in here? Well, there's one of the little constellation pieces that we need. Let's see what's up first. Let's see what's going on. Yes, uh, I did get a haircut. Well, I let the missus cut my hair. <laughs> it needed to go. It was uh, pretty rough, to say the least. It needed to be cut. It'll grow back. It'll grow back. All in due time. I don't even th my the place I go to isn't a uh, isn't open. Uh oh, oh oh no, oh no, we're going upside down mode now. Okay, I see you, game. <laughs> 
we're in the upside down. You let your sister cut your hair? My wife cut mine. I was like, okay, just chop it off. Whatever. We were going to attempt to cut it the way that I usually get it cut, but that wasn't going to happen. That was a no-go. Oops. And the Turing test. Optional side rooms. Delay the pressing of it. Yeah, I love those aha moments. Like, those are the things that I live for. Like, those are the things that are great, you know? Oh, shoot. I jumped way too early on that one. Like, the whole part of the, like, enjoying the puzzle games is, is the figuring out the puzzle part. Some people get frustrated. I understand. You know, it's, it can be a, it can be a little bit difficult sometimes. Oh, God, I did it again. I have to time that jump just right. Just right. It's going to be okay. But it's the fun part, you know? Okay, okay. Oh, no. Can I even go? Oh, I see. I see, I see, I see. Oh. Oh, I didn't do it. Okay, I, I, I'm i going to have to, like, walk off and then jump and then glide. I'll tell you what. One of the, like, one of the hardest platformers that I've ever played, though, was Celeste. Celeste was brutal. Like, that game. Oh, my God. Insanely difficult. Oh, bruh. Is that really how I'm supposed to do that? It's just a, it's just the right right um, order of steps. So this one, hmm. I'm look it up because there's no explanation or any other indication on how to complete it. I gotcha. No, there we go. You have to get that jump just right. It kind of throws you off because it's backwards. <laughs> this is awesome how that light lights up like that watercolor part right there. Such a feast for the eyes. Oh, I'm gonna go up this way. Well, this one's gonna be fun, I bet. Now we're gonna get real tricky with it. Oh, I need these. There we go. And since it's lit up... Aha! Ah, aha! I just want to live in this area. <laughs> I just want to stay here. I think there was some other place that I could go this way. I really don't know. Oh, wait. I only need two, don't I? I do believe I only need two for this spot. Which should give me a new color to the world as well. If it's the same game that I'm thinking of that I played... Um, I, got, I got stuck. Um... I think I got stuck on one puzzle pretty hard. What is that? It looks like an it looks like an ostrich, but also like a flamingo, like a mixture and a peacock. It's like all mixed together. I don't care because it's beautiful. Okay, let's go see what's down. I can't go either way of these. <gasps> they are like peacocks. <laughs> Okay. We're gonna go get our second piece. Constellation. We needs it. And we wants it. 
I'm sorry to disturb you, birds. It's not. It's not. Uh, it's not my fault. Say like some gardens in the heavens. Oh, I got the thing that I needed. Apparently. Eventually get it. Yeah. Later, like a year or more. You know, it's kind of like whenever you play stuff like that, and then you're like, you come back to it later, and it's like, how was I just overlooking this so hard? Like, not calling yourself stupid, but you're like, way over. I, well, I way overthink things way too much. That's my problem. I overthink way too hard on certain puzzles. Can I get this? Okay, I can. Oh. Oh, I didn't want to fall super fast. <laughs> I was nervous. Might be this one. There's a room in a big tower with a bell in the center of the tower. Ooh. Had a button to flip the tower. Oof. Oh, shoot. Break that. I can't go that way. I haven't really messed around with an upside down level part before. Or in, in a, I mean, I say part before, but in a game recently, you know. Usually they're kind of annoying. Oh. It's trippy though. <laughs> It'll trip you out, man. Okay. Oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I can almost touch it. Oh, I need these. <laughs> Hmm. Okay. Wait a minute. I want to see what's this way first. I don't want to miss out on something potential. Oh, it didn't literally didn't do anything. Ooh, this one's gonna be a little bit tricky. Oh, okay. All right. I can't leave out of the water. That was a tricky jump. <laughs> that was a tricky jump. But it's okay, though. Because we got it. Second piece. Be prepared for this. Because I, I guarantee you it is going to be awesome. Every one of these has been so amazing. Whoa, can I sing now? Oh. Yes. Yes. <laughs> that is awesome. Oh my god. That is freaking awesome. Wait, does that do anything? Oh, okay. Give me up here. Oh, what is this? What?
Oh my goodness. Well, I know we gotta go up there now. We absolutely have to go up there. Okay. What is at the top of this thing now? The colors are so just insane in this game. Oh, I need a lot more. I need six total. So I need, okay, I need four more. It's not too bad, not too bad. But now that we have the power of music on our side, we should be able to really see what what else awaits us. Now we gotta go on the other side and check that out. I told you it was gonna be awesome. <laughs> I warned you. Don't say I didn't warn you. I'm so glad that I turned the volume up a little bit. It was a little bit low yesterday. So what else does this open up? I guess we're gonna have to figure that out. What's plans for the season of the spring? Every. Just a amazing. She's our princess, and that's all that matters. <laughs> she is the apple to our eye. See, it's awesome because at the beginning of the game, she didn't have her voice. She lost her voice. And now we're gaining that voice back. We've gained friends. Oh, there's the piece. Okay, you gotta help me out here. Oh, wow, I'm gonna have to... Oh, whoa! Am I gonna be able to... No, there's no way! How can I actually... Oh, okay. Well, that's a thing. <laughs> I was like, how am I going to get to that? I only have a limited amount of time, though. <gasps> there we go. Yes. Can you do it in the air? Okay, you can't. Can you do like a little... Oh. I'm going to go up. Up. Up, up, and away. Oh, I think I see what we're going to do here. Let the water flow. And we can, oh, we can go, we can go up there. Malik is my princess. <laughs> uh, you stupid, yeah. <laughs> oh, bro, that's just... That's awesome. Wait, can I do anything with these plants? I just want to awaken all the plants. Oh, I just need to go down. Wasting my... Wasting my beautiful voice on the plants that don't want my voice. I need to be heard. Oh. So we gotta get four. Can I do it underwater? No, I can't do it underwater. Ooh, there's gotta be something there. Princess of the Sith Empire. Wow. Hey, the Sith need princesses too, right? They need princesses too. Nothing wrong with being a Sith princess. <laughs> I don't have a clue where I'm going. I'm going to be super honest. <laughs> I have no idea. But we're just going to go. That's all that matters. Oh, wait. We've already been this way. We don't need to go this way. With the prosthetic jaw I gave him. The only other person, the other one that I didn't really care for, uh, he's at the beginning of the game. Oh god, I can't remember his name. I didn't really use him much. Like, I kind of got rid of him. Like, he's a, He's got some nice qualities, but I can't remember his freaking name, though. 
So we need to go, we need to get back up to the top. Oh, we definitely have to go this way. There's no ifs, ands, or buts about it. Maybe now that since I have my voice, I can open up some more pathways. Yeah, Karth, that's who it was. Even his name is boring. <laughs> Karth. <laughs> It just seems, um, I don't know. It seems like he could be a little bit more. <gasps> oh, no. Okay, now we may be able to go a different path. I don't think I went this way, did I? Nope, I definitely did not go this way. I usually go left, but I didn't go left this time. Or I didn't go left the last time. I usually always go left first because it's the it's right. <laughs> I go left because it's right. Oh, more like oh nasty. Ooh. Oh, oh boy. All right. Here we go. Not wrong one. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, I'm gonna have to do this in the. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm gonna have to go over the middle. The middle. Oh, how did I miss? I had that. Oh, wait. Maybe if I didn't jump like a butthead. Oh, what the heck? What the heck? I can get here. Oh, that is such a tight jump. Okay, here we go. I keep doing the block. <laughs> now I have to get up there. We gotta get all the petals opened. That is so freaking cool. <laughs> I love that mechanic. <laughs> Sing to lead the path. I'm telling you, if I don't hear some word about tunic soon, I'm gonna be pretty uh be pretty upset. I'll really wanna see more of that. Because it looks great. The art style is fantastic. And the way that the uh Oh, I'm going to shut up now. Deep is cool mechanic is called Quantum Conundrum. I've heard of Quantum Conundrum. Oh, we got to get up there. There's got to be a way to get up there. There's got to be a way to get up in into this area. Wait, how am I going to... Am I going to have to fall off here? Standing on the edge of the universe. I ponder life's great mysteries. And I think to myself, that is mesmerizing. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Oh, that's where that comes into play. Oh wait, no, this is a different area. When I seen that block form, I thought of Kirby. That's what that's what that's what came to my mind. Was Kirby. Oh, wait. Hold up. I hope that y'all having a great Tuesday night, by the way. I appreciate y'all coming on by. Hanging out and watching some of this relaxing goodness. Sometimes it's good to take a break away from all of these games and just sit back and enjoy a nice relaxing experience, but also just be blown away. 
at the same time. Okay. I just don't want to miss anything, you know? I'd hate to miss some kind of secret or... I don't know. That would drive me up a wall. Maybe I need to go on the other opposite side now. Let's see. Yeah, I posted a clip of this on TikTok today, and it freaking blew up. People were just like, what is this game? And it's so pretty. And I'm like, I'm starting to tell them all about it. I love to introduce people to new games. Like, there's, there's a lot of stuff that they probably won't know about. You know, they're not familiar with some of the indie games that come out. And it's great to bring, you know, these games to more... You know, more possible players and also just lovers of the company, fans of the franchise, if they make more games, you know, it's, it's great, man. You could potentially feed into a whole new, a whole new generation of like fans. I love it. Oh. Whoops. Wait, can I do that with this one then? What is that? Are you chill? Walk, please. You're you're a friend, aren't you? Yes, you're a friend. Oh, I can kind of control him. By walking over here. It's probably the only creepy-ish thing, I guess you could say, that I've seen in this game so far. But not really creepy though. Because we have the rock the rock dudes with the metal legs. Alright. I don't think you have any more places you can take me, friendo. I will take that and I will be on my way. I'm sorry. I feel bad because, like, they help me in the night. They can't come with me. You know? Kind of sucks. <laughs> it's bittersweet friendships, you know? But we're not using them. We're, we're taking great solace in their help. And we will thank them kindly. Oh! Okay. I did not expect to go that far into the uh, sky there. Oh man. Simple mechanics, but man, if they're executed well, like you don't need crazy, fancy, just mind breaking or, or genre breaking mechanics. Just be a little bit innovative with some, some platforming, you know? It is a little difficult to be innovative in some areas. I understand that, but. Little tweaks. You don't need much. Also, the thing to point out with this game is there's no dialogue. I mean, there's no telling. Ooh, that looks like a looks like a bug almost, doesn't it? Like with the wings. Please tell me I get to wake this thing up. Yes. Now I can get on and we can go for a ride. Oh, yes. Ooh, this one's going to get tricky. Oh, I need to go on the other side. I just seen it. <laughs> You get so small on the screen sometimes. <laughs> Come on, my bug friends. Yes. Awesome job. Wake every flower up. We need all of them awake. 
The only thing I've noticed so far with this game is there is some audio cutouts. I don't know why. Just very brief. Very brief. Man, I want to go up there. We have all the pieces we need. I gotta take a screenshot of this. Ready for it. To the cosmos. these back right where they're needed now I can't not think about that uh the thing you're talking about with the shadow <laughs> wait Now we get to go up the tree. Oh wait, wrong way. I didn't go all the way back. I was still in the puzzle area. My bad. That's where I need to be. Where the giant moon is. Wait, I need to go up. Take me to where I must go. Yes. Right at the upside down. Oh, all the ones I've gotten so far? Oh, my path. Well, we know where we must go. To the heavens above. How am I going to get there, though? See, look at all these secrets that I've missed. And these are definitely... Yeah, this is the ups... Okay, now I see. This is the upside-down area. Or back and forth. Oh, shoot. Everybody's... <laughs> they're thanking me for letting them know about Gris. Oh, there you go.
There we go. Man, so many people like that video. Oh! God dang it. <laughs> Has, wow. I mean, moist. Moist is the word I would be looking for. Hello. I was replying to somebody on TikTok. I'm sorry. <laughs> My perfectly sized forehead, thank you very much. For thank you for noticing my perfectly sized forehead. It is Move out! My perfectly sized forehead, thanks you for that follow. Welcome to the brigade. Catalyst rise rise. Thank you so much. Thank you for the raid, Asky Boy. You joined us on Gris, my dude. Miss mine before the raid? No, you have a nice smile. I seen that. I seen the smile. It's like, thank you. I said thank you for the smile comment. I'm actually really self-conscious of my smile, but thank you very much. Much appreciated. Thank you for the raid. How is... How is everybody tonight? Let me get a cast command for my boy. My boy. Smart. A ski. Bro, this game, oh, it is gorgeous, to say the least. Gorgeous. Let me pause this for a second for station identification. Not really, but to welcome the Raiders in properly. Let's do the dang thing. I want to see your booties in the air. Give me, give me, give it to me, give it to me. Get ready. Yeah, boy. I want to see your butts. I want your butts. Bring your raid goodness in here with that. Uh, uh. The butts, the bananas, and the butts again. Spike nose. I love those bananas. Yes, yes, yes. Welcome to the... <laughs> Joy, I gotta switch this because it's gonna go to the wrong scene. There we go. Bada bing, bada boom. Um, the Visage waiting room. You are correct. Chapter 2 takes forever, but that's good. I'm glad. Thank you for the raid. Welcome in, raiders. My name is Tubin Monkey. I am a variety streamer. I love to play Dark Souls type games, indie games, and I'm a Battlefield fan, ah, to say the least. I'm also a... Uh, uh, southern streamer, streamer from the south, and uh, welcome into our lovely little channel here on Twitch. I'm playing Gris tonight. This game is absolutely just mind-blowingly beautiful. I'm a variety washer and all around obese gentleman. No, you're a gentleman, not obese. But you have a lot to love, okay? Lots to love. Us, us, us husky guys. We need love too. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate you in your, in your wholeness. But thank you. Can you write me a note? I could write you a note. Um, please excuse Brett from work for the rest of the week. My writing is terrible too, so that works fantastically. <laughs> Hopefully I sound like a doctor. It doesn't sound like annoying or boring, you know? Here, see, I appreciate his wholeness. Wholeness. How was your stream though? Red Dead Redemption 2? I want I want fair. I want I want legit. I want no lies. I want to know how many horses that ASCII has killed. Which to be, truth be told, we're probably gonna be in that realm anyways, because after we finish Gris, we're gonna play Sea of Solitude, and after Sea of Solitude, we're gonna play Red Dead Redemption 2. I didn't kill any, all caps. No cap, all caps. Oh, snap. <laughs> I didn't kill any. Kills four. What is going on with my cord? Yikes. Okay, crashed. I'll, I'll give it that. A crash is okay. <laughs> Yeehaw? Question mark? <laughs> I can't wait to play more um, Visage. We're going to play this weekend for a, another charity stream. Scare me. Special goodness. By the way, Hare, how much money have you raised? I mean, regardless, a dollar raise is fantastic. Um, equal amounts, you know. I'm just curious. Because, uh, by the way, for those of you who do not know, 
Hair is also raising money for St. Jude. And she is fantastic. And I appreciate all that she does. It's an awesome charity event that all amazing streamers, everybody who's participating, is raising awareness and also money for the kids. 856 on personal, 309. Bah, that is awesome. And look, every little bit counts. We're almost at two mil. Two mil. 87 cents. Uh, that's awesome. 87 cents raised is 87 cents raised. It is crazy. And I guarantee we're going to hit two mil. Like, I've been spreading as much as I, you know, information and awareness. And that's the biggest thing is bringing awareness to it. And I, it's unfortunate that a lot of people look at oh this streamer raised more money than than me or this streamer is getting more recognition for how much money they raised the bottom line is we're doing this for a greater cause we're doing this for something beyond ourselves it's not a fighting you know scenario it's not a it's not a race it's not a contest it's about doing the right thing and it's about raising awareness for a cause that is for the children and i think that is the biggest thing you know that's that's what that's what it's all about, you know. Even if I never raised a single dime, if I could bring awareness to it, then that alone is worth the time, you know. I'll need a receipt for my tax return. <laughs> I've really been happy with what I've been able to, to to do. Yeah. Oh yeah, exactly. Yes. Yeah. And see, like I. If I was off, like if I was at home, I mean, I got, I, we never got any kind of stay from stay home orders or whatnot, like for our work, because I'm working oil field considered essential, you know. So we never had that time. But if I did, then I would have definitely tried to push even more of that during my time off. But, uh, but I'll do what I can the time that I can. You know what I'm saying? Even when I'm not streaming, I'm just spreading the awareness retweeting stuff that St. Jude tweets out liking stuff comment you know yeah there are no taxes anymore IRS is over yes <laughs> yes taxes no <laughs> they'd be like tax man and you'd just tell them no and then they'd be like well well they said no it's like when somebody tries to like like the like the ghost tries to touch your feet and you cover them up with the blankets it's like it's the same thing right it's the same thing gotta run Ooh, liver's floating. Appreciate you coming on by, Brett. With that fantastic raid. For those of you tuning in, we're gonna be playing. We're playing Gris. It's amazing. It's a, a feast for the eyes. They're, they're so, exactly. Catch your boner tomorrow. Wow. We're really. I think we're really close to the end of this game. By the way, absolutely mind blowing. And like I posted a video up on TikTok and it has it's kind of blown up a little bit and it was literally just a, a, a clip of the game. Oh, it's got 25,000 views on it. That's cool. <laughs> I didn't know that that was going to happen, but okay. Um, and what does it got like tooth? Oh, tooth. Okay. That's, that's fucking weird, man. Stuff goes viral that I just don't understand. TikTok is weird, but I love TikTok. I don't know if anybody else is on there. I'm on there. I love to make videos and content and stuff like that. Not the sheets. Ghosts are afraid of blankets. Yeah, not sheets. They're too thin. They're too thin. They're not filled with all the all the fluffy goodness, you know. Oh. I was just telling everybody in chat like how I literally listen to this this soundtrack all day at work. Better quarantine? I know. I'm sorry. Shouldn't be out and about. Spread my nastiness all over the interwebs. <laughs> oh, not you again. Oh, he's supping, he's sapping the color out of the world. We have I was so close. 
Oh, man. Man, this game is something. <laughs> it's it doesn't tell you anything, but man, is it rich. Trying to swim out of this abyss. Oh no, I don't want to hit that. Quietly we'll move through. It's like ski free. For those of you who remember what that is, don't want to touch the rocks. <laughs> Wait, do I want to go into this? I can't see anything. It's really dark and I'm scared. Oh. Oh, it's not nice at all. Come on, get out of that. Wait, do we have our voice still? Yes. Oh, Jesus, cannolian. Romo! This dude coming in with a raid. Look at you, man! Look at you coming in here. Just got hit with the fantastic raid, and then bringing up with another fantastic raid. How are you doing? It's Livion Sun. Welcome back. Romo, how was your stream? Uh, I gotta get you a cast to come in, my friend. We're deep. We're deep on the second day. Gotta get your Bromo. For those of you who don't know Bromo, Bromo Rangers, go go. Uh, fellow friend, OG YouTube fam. And he is on his way to affiliate. Raid alert always scares me. Everything scares me. And the missus with the host of Reno. Thank you so much. How you doing? How was your Bioshock Infinite? Oh, appreciate the raid. Let me get y'all welcomed in here properly. Cause I am messing up all my buttons. All right, let's do things here. We gotta do a little raid hype here. Boy, let's do it. Let's do it. I want your booties in the air. You know the drill. Get yo. Get it on the floor, baby. She's going bananas. Yes. Lit up cool cat. Bring it around town, baby. Bring it around town. Oh, yeah, boy. Oh my god, no. <laughs> that hot dog. <laughs> Cheesy dog. Bring it in the hot love. Bring it in, baby. I gotta fix this thing to where it goes to the right scene. Because it doesn't go back to the right scene. Because I haven't fixed it. Because I'm a bad streamer. Thank you for the raid. Hopefully your stream was fantastic. Welcome in, raiders. It is, uh, as they say in the YouTube days, it's your boy, Tube and Monkey. Be sure to like, subscribe. <laughs> Hit that notification bell. No. Um, welcome back. Hopefully you had a good stream. I know uh, my boy Bromo here is trying to get to affiliate. He's been getting heavy back into his streaming game and uh, awesome, awesome fellow. Just a full, just full of optimism. I love his face. Appreciate you, man. Appreciate you. We're 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 playing Gris again because this game I couldn't stop thinking about it, and it's amazing. Literally my favorite thing ever. You like that? You liked it? You like it? Do you like it though? But do you like it? Do, but do you like it though? Do you really? <laughs> I love my I love my animated stuff. It's 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 it gives me life. Except so. 
I don't want to spoil anything, so I'm not even going to say what my synapsis is of this so far. Kind of can piece some things together, but I'm not going to say anything for those that are curious on playing it. I'm just going to enjoy it and not go in the death water. Thought I couldn't like it enough, and then you went and played the killers. Uh, the man is the shit. <laughs> That's my favorite song. That is the song of life right there. That song gives me life. Where are we? Ascending. So we had to come to terms with I'm not I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say. I'm not gonna say. The question is, where does that lead us? I don't know if that leads us anywhere. But we'll see. We'll see. But thank you again for the raid. It's always appreciated. Hopefully you had a good stream. And hopefully everybody's having a good Tuesday. We are continuing our playthrough of Gris and preparing ourselves for Sea of Solitude. Um, depending on if we finish this today, we may play it tomorrow. I don't know. We're going to see. Don't want to make any assumptions, but I think based on how tonight went. <sighs> yes, 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 yes. And then they're going to hit you with that email and you're going to be like, yes, yes, yes. That's how he's going to be when he opens his email. <laughs> yeah, check it. Well, it does have the update. It does have the update. That's how he's going to be. Open it. I'll tell you what. It may seem like a small thing for some people. Like affiliate status, you know, not a... may not be a huge thing. Um, I remember when I hit affiliate that I literally was at a loss because... To me, it did feel, I mean, on the grand scheme of things, I mean, it does give you options for stuff like subs and bits and things like that, but it gave me that little sense of validation that the work that I was doing was appreciated by the people within my community enough to take it to the next level, you know? Now, that just means that the journey is only beginning. I mean, even if those had hit partner, that's just the beginning. That's just the beginning of the journey, you know? It's not just a, I'm here, I can stop. It doesn't work that way. But hitting affiliate definitely gives you that sense of, hey, the work that I'm doing is appreciated. You know, the the content that I'm making is obviously enjoyable and people want to support it to a degree that it opens up the gateway to more things. And also gives you a good idea of that you're making progress. So some people may discredit the affiliate thing, but in my eyes, it's a great way to see that you're improving and you're growing and you know, you're doing something right. You're doing something right. And I love that. And I love to see people hit those goals. Wait, can I? Oh. Rebuild it. Hands off. Mouth shut.
Trying to take that in for a minute. That kind of hit me out of the left field. God damn, that was beautiful. What do you say to something like that? What do you even say? Oh yeah, I got to screenshot this. That is... Like, I don't want to leave. How do you leave? God, these games, boy, they hit you hard, yeah. I swear they know how to get you yeah. <laughs> Thank you. 
That's two games that have done that now. Two. The other one was Ori. Was beautiful. <laughs> Can download previous chapters and visit the gallery. Ooh. At least they give us uh some some pretty extras to look at. Oh, they have the music in here? Unused works. What is this? Oh, that's cool. Oh, this is cons. Oh, we're gonna look at this. Man. That was... That was something else. I don't know... I don't know what it is. I mean, I know that some of these things really <laughs> it's hard to talk about it <laughs> Appreciate you. Thank you for coming on by, Leviosa. It's awesome having you here. Coming in from uh, Bromo Stream. Sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> not prepared for that ending that came out I mean I knew I, I had an idea you know damn right about that <laughs> It's like even the concept art basically translated straight to the game. You know? Doesn't seem, except for her dress. Seems like they had a different idea for her dress. That looks awesome. I remember that scene. Oh, that looks a little bit different than what we've seen in the underwater level. That seems to almost like a jellyfish. Pretty cool to see concept art for things that they 
potentially could put in the game, but maybe it just didn't work quite out the way that they expected it to, you know? And her design is very simple, but so... It, it, it commands such a amazing presence in, in the world. Oh, yes. The little cube guy. Oh. The little pets. There's so many things that I missed, too, which kind of sucks. Oh, the legs rock person. <laughs> Remember the legs rock person. Is this the oh, is this the overall world in a sense kind of is Oh, this is how all the chapters are broken up. So yeah, you can go back. I just don't know if I can get all the stuff and it would count towards it. Now the question is, does that mean that there's like a a true ending or complete ending? Man, that's that's beautiful. I can't, I can't put it any other way. You really can't. How can how can you how can you say it any different way? If there's any if there's ever a time when if there's ever a time when people want to question if games are art, when it can evoke emotion to that degree, I, I don't know what else you can call it. I mean, granted, it obviously is down to interpretation and how it affects you as a person. There's things that it's hard to talk about. Damn. But it was good, though. It was a short ride, but it was an amazing one. Yeah, you don't need convoluted story. You don't need all that fluff. It, it just... It's the power of storytelling, but in a simple way, you know? The music really gets me, though. I think, because to me, music holds such a... To me, music is such a deep, like, pool of emotion that you could just... And it doesn't even have to be lyrical. It could just be harmonious. It can it can be just instrumental, but it can it can hit you in a different way. You know? The tones, the notes, the, the composition of it. Uh, I don't know. For some they may not they may not see those things, they may not feel that way. I can't hide the way I feel about it. I'm not going to do that. I feel almost upset at myself by the fact that I didn't play this sooner. But who knows, maybe it just it wasn't the right time to play it. You know? Now was the time that it was meant to be, and now is the time that it was. And I'm glad that I did. See, I know I know I know less I knew less about this game than Sea of Solitude. And Sea of Solitude is we're gonna start that tomorrow because we finished this today. It's, huh. it's like scary streams on Saturdays, emotional, heartstring, tugging, emotional. Uh, I don't know. It's ups and downs, man. It's just, uh, it's such an amazing experience. I wish there was, I mean, can I go back? If I hit continue, what does that do? Because if I can go back and get those pieces. Oh, this did this. I wonder if that's just going to pick me right back up where I left off. Oh, no, I'd have to pick chapters. I would definitely have to pick chapters. But I don't think it would allow me to collect all the pieces. And I'm wondering if those things are going to lead to... I don't know. I don't know what that would lead to. Chapters. 
And look, there's not even, like, there's not much. You don't need all that excess, you know? Just, this is proof that you can, I mean, granted, it's beautiful. It's well-crafted. It's, the art style and design are just amazing. But it's not excessive, you know? You don't need all that extra. I didn't mean to take y'all on a feels train. I'm sorry. And I don't want to say, I don't want to give some, some, some streamlined synapses of the game. I think, I think it's best interpreted on its own by those that played and enjoy it. I mean, you can, you can tell by some of the, 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 the themes, you know, we knew we were boarding choo choo, <laughs> choo choo QQ. It's awesome though. And, uh, First of all, I do want to say this. Kudos to Nomada Studios. And of course, Devolver Digital. Um, I will give you some much due applause. This game did come out in the end of 2018. It came out in December. Uh, I highly recommend it. Even if you've watched play it, playing it yourself is definitely a different experience. Um, so I, I highly recommend checking it out. There's a lot of great platformers lately. There's been a lot of good ones. Like I said, Ori and the Will of the Wisp was really good. And now this. I was like, how is Sea of Solitude going to follow? I mean, I'm not saying it needs to follow up and, and, and step up to the plate or anything like that. But it's just like, once you feel like you've played a game that has hit you in a certain way, it's like, how can the next game top it that way? You know? It's just, it's awesome, man. It's awesome. It's absolutely awesome. Yes, yeah, so take me to the main menu. I almost wish there was more artwork for us to look at. I'm definitely gonna have to get a piece. Like, like this. I love this with those greens in there, which I can barely see. But another one that I thought was really good is this one. This scene right here is really nice. You have a bit of the. The, the red, well you have the red and then you have, I guess it's green, it's hard for me to see. And you have those, the yellow in the background. This doesn't have the, it has a little bit of the blue it looks like. It, or gray. In her hair. This one too. I like the forest, when we played through the forest area that was really nice. It's just storytelling with, with the levels, you know, that. Those are the unsung heroes of some of these games where a lot of a lot of titles rely heavy on the protagonist to carry the story. But there's many cases where the levels themselves, like the environments, are the, are telling such a great story. You just have to pay attention, you know. And some people just overlook that, and it sucks because there's some amazing artistry that goes into this time and effort crafted into these beautiful worlds. <laughs> it's just unreal. Trying to see. Too bad there isn't a way I can like zoom in on this because this is a little bit different. Oh, those are the clouds that you would go up. Which was where the bird well the bird wasn't there. Bird was at the beginning of the game. Up here. Then we had the eel. So so awesome. And then like you don't even need a sequel. Like, literally, encompassed all in one. Fantastic. 